Hey everyone, Zoe here and today I want to show you how to do the classic red lippy look. Now if you're looking for the classic red lippy look there's only one red out there that you can use and it has to be the lip scent blue red. I'm talking pillar blocks red here, I'm talking pretty woman red. This is the one red that really rules them all. If you want that classic red look you need blue red. So before we start, as always, make sure your lips are clean and dry, which I've already done, make sure they're extra dry. And then after you um, you're gonna scrape most video, we just want the applicator to be damp, you really don't need a lot. And where I start is I start on the cupid's bow because that's the bit you really want to emphasize to give you that nice classic red lippy look is start on your cupid's bow and you're going to kind of want to make a little cross there and what i do is i actually use the tip of my lip scent applicator so i flip it round instead of using the flat bit i use the tip can you see what i did I literally just made a little cross in the middle and that's going to give me like the perfect V um, to give me that lip look that I want. Make sure to get your waterline as well, really important. great V right there in the middle and then I'm going to do my bottom your waterline again and then again just to kind of straighten up that edge I'm just going to use the other end of my applicator And that's the first layer. I'm scared to put on red, ladies. Honestly, the red is just such a sexy colour to wear. And if you're all about making mistakes, that's what your ultra remove is for. So I'm going to go ahead and do the second layer again, scraping most of it back in. And then again, I'm just going to line the bottom, flip it round. You can also use a lining, use the applicator. that dry and then last layer again see if I see lips your um I know how he's talking doing this, but video purposes. <laughs> I 
Yeah, sorry about the slur, and it just cons along with putting your lips ends on. <sighs> See, my actual action on. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. And I'm going to be using glossy, but I will show you how to make it matte. See that red lippy and my applicator is still white. That is the power of lip sales. Your classic red va va boom. Pretty woman, hello, look at me, Miss Gorgeous. Red. So what I was saying is there is two ways you can wear the red. Well, there's lots of ways you can wear the red because there's about, I think there's about nine different glosses you can wear. But the most ways we wear it is either the glossy, which is my favourite because the glossy is the most moisturising, gorgeous, loveliness, amazing, buttery feeling on your lips. Um, but you can do it a matte way. So first of all, I'm going to show you, because I put already put the blue red twice on my hand here and we're just going to do a bit of comparison for you so that is it on the bottom right there that is your glossy finish which is the one i'm rocking or we can do the matte finish now the matte gloss isn't as moisturizing as the glossy gloss i have to tell you that now just mainly to give you that matte finish to give you that gorgeous matte finish it's not going to be as moisturizing it still is moisturizing it still has all the same gorgeous ingredients in but just not as much obviously to give you that matte effect so i'm just going to pop that on my hand there or you can wear it matte and that's it ladies that is how to wear lip scent to blue red and get that classic gorgeous red lippy sexy woman lip um any questions or want to order blue red i do have it in stock just click the link in the description speak to you all again soon bye